Well, Joe, great to see you back on the field and playing, but a really disappointing result. Yeah, no, it's, um, yeah, obviously it's nice to be back out there, but it's been dampened by the result, really. And um, what a goal from Jordan Barnett to open the scoring, but the reaction after it, defensively, you weren't at your best. Yeah, I think um, we were building into the game, to be fair, when George scored, I think um, we were the team on top. And obviously we got the goal, it was a great finish from George. And then, um, yeah, I think in a derby like that, we can't, as a team, defend like that. It just can't happen. Of course, you didn't play in the Boxing Day game, but what's it like playing the same opposition so quickly after each other? Mentally, it must be quite difficult. Yeah, I think obviously um, I wasn't there the Boxing Day, so it was a bit different this year. But normally, obviously, the result goes one way Boxing Day and then you try and you try and change the result um, the following week if you've lost or build on it if you've won. So, yeah, we'll be disappointed with what with what's happened in the end there. But, um, yeah, we've got, to, we've got to go again. And Darren made three attacking substitutions yourself. Ruben and Sonny it did make a difference didn't it just couldn't get that second goal yeah no I thought I thought we were on top to be fair I thought um, Jordan's goal came at a good time I think um, like you said if we can go and get a second there or or keep out there first I think the game the game goes a different way and a lot of changes at the back of course a new goalkeeper coming in is that difficult for the team to adjust to um I don't think we can use it as an excuse, to be honest. Everyone's everyone's good enough to come in and do a job and um, we just not, not performed there at the end. And you've been out for a couple of months, but you came on, made a real difference. You said you're feeling feeling strong. How, how are you recovering? Yeah, no, I'd, uh, we had a good full week training. Obviously, the game was cancelled Tuesday, so it gave it gave me a chance to, to have a good full week training with the team and I felt sharp in training. And um, yeah, I've just got to keep building from that. And on a personal level, you're still top scorer at the club. I'm guessing you're going to want to uh, add to those as the season goes on. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's time to kick on now. Like um, individually and as a team, we've got to, we've got to improve. And two disappointing league losses. Is it kind of good that you get to focus on the FA Cup now? Um, yes, yes, and no. Obviously, the lads the lads would rather a game sort of straight away in the league to put things right. But obviously, it gives us a great chance to move forward in the cup, which we'll be looking to do. You know the history of Yeovil Town in the cup. You must all be so up for it and wanting to get a starting place. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, you shouldn't need much motivation other than other than the fact we've got we've got the third round tie. So yeah, no, we'll be up for it. And lastly, it was a, a wonderful unbeaten run while you were out injured and two losses in a row. It's important not to go on a, a run of not, of not winning again. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, I think um, in the changing rooms we've said it's, it's runs are one. We need, to, we need to focus on the next game and forget, and forget about the future.